Hi, this is Dan, and I'm back with more Let's Play of Crush Deluxe. So, we've been on quite a losing streak uh, recently, so I want to see if we can turn that around in this game. Um, and I realized uh, for the last one that we forgot to um, to look at our... Well, I clicked didn't register. Okay, still not okay. Uh, we forgot to look at our guys to see if we could uh, level up their abilities, so we want to do that uh, before the game this time. And I think we do that by going in here. And we go to our trainer. So, uh, can we see? Yeah, he's got something, so we've been trying to level up his agility. Um, do we want to go for scoop? This is dodge ability and jump. All right. Let's go with boxing. Quimus will also go with boxing. Curtis, he barely has any skill points. Brog, alright, he's got a lot. Um, I don't know if we want to get up to charge with our with our um, Gronks. Uh, okay, he doesn't have enough. Doug is working, working on agility, probably. Alright. Uh, combo. Give him gymnastics. Paul will give him boxing. Mark doesn't have any. Kevin doesn't have enough. Baramus doesn't have enough. Alright, and that's our team, so I'll head back to the schedule. Yeah, I'm not sure that there's a whole lot I can do better this time to, um, to improve our odds. Uh, so here we go, simulate all the computer games. I mean, I don't think I've been playing especially badly. I mean, I think our team is just, um, you know, I probably made a mistake in the first uh, first game, just not uh, spending all our money on uh, on guys. So the injuries have been really hurting us because we've had basically no alternates uh, except for uh, some of the humans and. Uh, that's been rough for us. So, but I mean, also last time we were close, I think we just got some bad luck uh, at like a critical juncture that uh, we couldn't um, we couldn't get the ball where it needed to be. So, you know, maybe just uh, keep trying and it'll, it'll turn around for us. Uh, I think that if it does, that's probably going to compound a bit, because I think the things that give you the skill points to level up are also things that tend to result in you winning games, so it's kind of like there's a, a virtuous cycle there. Um, the other problem is potentially the uh, the AI teams might be having their own virtuous cycles and uh, getting further and further ahead of us. Yeah, it looks like the gut eaters did well there. Yeah, we're still waiting. Yeah, friends of eight. We hate these guys. So they, I think they've beat us a few times and they use a lot of vortex armor. So, so they're my... Uh, like our, 
our rival, our league rivals or something. I don't know. Yeah, it's a little bit weird to um, to attempt to commentate over these uh, uh, computer matches because, like, you can sort of see what's going on, but by the time I register, like, some of the interesting stuff, it's already you know bounced to a another you know what's happening next. So it's like I can't, I don't want to be a couple steps behind. All right. So here we go. So I'm liking what's going on here a little bit more. We've got Dragorans, so they look like they're a player down, and Kermians, I think we've beaten these guys before, so so this might be a better matchup for us than the previous few uh, few games. Although the Kermians are um, they can be rough if they get the ball early. That happened in one of our first losses. Alright, so do we want to go up here? Or over there, I think. He's going to get those, so we'll head up this way. And it gives us, gets us close to two. He's got magnetic boots. Right, reinforced armor, booster belt, and SAI belts. Well, things are going well for us so far in that we're we're getting guys into the arena and they're not, so. Alright. That's good. He didn't get the ball. I think this guy might be closer. Yeah. So we'll let him activate this one first. Okay. I'm not sure if we're going to be able to get here. Yep, just enough. Alright. Alright. We've got the, uh... We've got the ball. We've got a pretty fast player. So we need to be able to try to, to capitalize on that. Um, nobody else has anybody in position yet, but... There's sort of like a central corridor in this uh, this arena, so we're gonna have to get past them. See, so like all these guys beaming in, they're essentially between us and the goal, because so, the goal is down here in the lower left. Right, it's the the fur whatever furthest. Uh, corner is from where the ball was found is where you need to get it. Alright, well, so we've got Curtis here to be sort of a blocker. So we'll just get him as far forward as we can. And then Quiemus. Just gonna just go as fast as he can go. And this guy is gonna 
come around and start uh, getting into position back here. So we're reasonably well set up. Uh, I can't can't really think of anything I'd ask for better than this. So I think we've got a really good chance here. Uh, obviously, this is a little bit rough, and uh, Gregorin uh, beaming in behind us, but we've got to expect that to happen a little bit. You know, we're going to get some bad luck, but our guy is uh, pretty good, so he stayed on his feet, which is great. Hermians, I think, are going to have a tough time. So they tend to, um, you know, they're they tend to be better when they have possession, but they're not the greatest checkers, you know, in the in the league. Although, you know, some of them might have equipment and stuff that makes them better. But I think the bigger risk is uh, the Dragorans that we've got to get past. Okay. Um, I don't know if trying to do a check from on top of the teleport pad is a... Alright, well. I was going to say, I don't know if it's a bad idea, but... worked out for us, so. Yeah. I have some weird, uh, like the interaction of the mouse and the full screen graphics and stuff is kind of weird and uh, frustrating. But, that's not that big a deal. Okay, so this. I think what we want to do is have Curtis come down here. Well, alright, that wasn't exactly what I had in mind. got 30 more points to play with, so I think coming in. down here is the best, so I think you can get around us a little bit, but I think that makes the, um, the best use of uh, the position that we can get. Nice. So that's going to help us get out ahead of that guy. He'll be slowed down a little bit. Not much because he's a Dragoran, but it's better than nothing. Oh, all right. Well, uh, the guy knocked himself out with his own belt. And unfortunately, a new one beamed in right there. Or it might have been the same guy. Alright. So, my uh, Queen and Mrs. Uh, electric gloves are doing great work for us. So for once, things went really well for us there, between turns. And we 
usually uh, it feels like in these episodes I start and say, oh, well, this will go all right. And then just as, uh, as the turn goes on, it's like, well, okay, it's not that great, but it's still, uh, no, yeah, but here things all worked out. Um, okay, so I think what I'm going to do is try to take out this Kermine here. Huh. That's not a good sign, that red. Uh, he's probably got some kind of kind of boosting equipment that's making him more effective than your average Kermian. Yeah, but at least he's down now. Right, this guy. We want... Here, I think that's where we want to be. Gronk. Yeah. We'll follow behind, and he'll be sort of a Defending us from the back. And then, let's see, who's this? This guy's got 10. So we're probably better off going here. That gives us, I think, better reaction check possibilities. And this guy, I think, we go here, I think that get, makes him more kind of in the way for um, for this guy. And I think that's the best we can do. Now let's see how they react to that. Alright, they got all another lucky beam in. But we still have, like, we've got a lot of guys in the area, so at least he didn't get possession. But now this, uh, the Kermian's gonna get the, uh, their turn. And there's, alright, another one taken out by his own belt. Now it's Crawda back again. Hopefully the uh, the ball won't do the thing where it like crawls in the wrong direction so much that, uh, that basically the uh... all right uh, Intimus doing some good work for us there. I'm not sure exactly what the AI was thinking, but you know, that guy is out of the picture. Okay, step one, gonna be, take this guy out if we can. Okay, uh, step one A is gonna be, take this guy out. Okay, we sort of got him. Um, I think we've got to try that. All right. So, Untimus is going to try. 
Okay, Intimus has the ball. People are getting some ice cold drinks to enjoy while watching Intimus race this thing to the end. Alright. Right here. And we've got these guys in the back. So. This guy, I think I'm just going to go after this uh, Kermian. Just to get some uh, experience. Because I think he's too far out of position to... Um, oh, nice. Uh, I don't know if we get get credit for causing that fatality or if the, kind of the claws get credit, but... Good that uh, we heard him. So uh, here, I think we want to go up here. And we'll throw a check at this guy. And throw another check at him. Because if we can knock him down. Well, we can't. But uh, I think we're kind of blocking him in here, so unless somebody gets really lucky with the teleport, uh, we're pretty well positioned here. to get somewhere because uh, Kermians are fast. And especially he's got some kind of booster belt on it looks like. He's got 90 AP. Alright, well we got the lucky teleport. That's interesting. Just want to do this. Um, so tentatively, I'm just going to leave him there to defend against anyone beaming in. But I might run up to defend against that uh, Kermian instead. Okay, so this guy's only got 30 AP. So, I think we want to come down like so. And this guy. Come over here. And I'm just trying to get get my guys in position to get a lot of um, assist points when we throw our checks. Alright, so first is going to be Doug. That didn't work. Next is going to be Quintus. Next is going to go after this guy. Nice. Uh, 
And... Well, can't win them all. did not work. Uh, so where's that? Gronk is there. I think it doesn't make sense to move him anywhere else. He's this guy. He's got 50. That's good. Who's this? With 30. You know, this guy back here. Might as well run down here. Alright, so I think I think we're good to go. I'm a little bit worried about that Kermian uh, near the uh, near the goal, but I think it also makes sense to guard against uh, other people coming out of that teleporter. Yeah, we didn't get the reaction check there, but yeah, he can't get close. All right, interesting. He's he's serving as an obstacle. We got a nice check there. Kermian did not beam in anywhere, anywhere that was useful. Nice. Okay, so I'm not sure about this, but I think you might get um, bonus points for being in the end zone when the ball is there. So I'm going to have this guy run in first. Um, nobody else is close enough, but we've got an unex uh, unobstructed shot with Untimus. And here we go. All right, that's more like it. That's the kind of thing we want to see all the time here. All right, rushing. Obviously, Quimus uh, did quite a lot, and to missed a little bit as well. Checking, our guys did pretty well. Um, well, at least Untimus did he threw five. Uh, yeah, this guy is pretty good. Uh, Sacks, let's see. Yeah. Carnage. Okay, this is where we, we did a lot. Quiemus did a lot of injuries. And yeah, Curtis uh, killed someone. <laughs> and Untimus got an injury. Uh, overview. We had. Five ball control, one fumble, activated two pens, and our MV MVP. I'm gonna guess it's gonna be Untimus. Yep, it's because he uh, he got the final score, so that that tends to give you a bonus um, bonus to being selected as MVP. And he did some other good stuff in there. Right? He threw some checks. He, uh, he got uh, some carnage. So. All right, that is another victory, which is good. It breaks our losing streak. Maybe that's the uh, sign that we've turned this thing around. And uh, I'm not sure how many games there are in the season until you get to the, um, the tournament at the end. But that was that week, so I'm going to end it there. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye.